Shooting it raw? Yes. Shooting it raw. You're in what looks like, uh, uh, so you're standing at a table with, you know, with basically uh, printouts of your book. It's a mm -hmm. commercial sort of space. And you're we're yeah. wearing all black. You have a black mask because you're you're at a at a conference or something or or, or trade yes. show. You're wearing you're wearing one of those like passes around your neck. Uh, so mm -hmm. your hair is bright bright red, uh, which now you said it was a wig. That's fine, but you're wearing this <laughs> shirt that's really quite it's really quite uh, playful. So the shirt is like you have a, it comes with a hood and your neck is exposed. And you've got you've got like this nice necklace with a little bit of red inside, so it matches your your hair very well. So you have a good sense of style. A Melisandre necklace, but it was a small oh, okay. one. Bronze Melisandre, the, the the witch kind of woman. <laughs> right, right. Well, you look. Well, it's a very playful outfit that you're wearing. Uh, so it looks like a very very large conference hall, because it's a, it's a close shot image of you. But I can just see through. The, the curtain in the back, the lights are at a very, very high ceiling. So this is probably a very large room. So, so what am I looking at? What, what is this? Okay, so here in uh, Houston, we have Comic Palooza, which is okay. a comic -Con convention, right? So every year we have one, and then usually like uh, some celebrities come and writers and actors and people that do comic magazines and stories and things like that and my publisher here you know my american publisher inklings publishing uh because they also here from houston texas they yeah. always she always buys a table because there is like vendor area right so she always right. buys a table at the at this convention because it's the largest comic con in texas and uh so we go there so we do like signings and there's also literary track so they invite us as writers to do some uh, teaching to talk you know to do debates to have panels and i've been lucky enough that for the last what probably five six years i've been a guest speaker at the comic losers here in houston and i've had the chance to interact with a lot of uh, some famous uh writers as well moderate the panels you know talk about the writing process and not only that but we also can stay at the table you know looking at people we come a lot of people come in in, in different costumes because there's a lot of cosplay involved in this yeah in yeah famous people so that is one of the things that is pretty cool that we do every year of course in 2020 it was cancelled but this one yeah. is Typically, it's from last year. So last year in July, they reopened it and we had to be, you know, it was mask only because it was kind of middle sort of the pandemic still, but we already had sure. some people vaccinated. So it was uh, mask required and all that, but we did. And then I was, I mean, I had this, I had, usually I have costumes that are more like medieval and, but I have this one, which is like a long dress with a hood. It's like a black dress, like a, like, uh, it's not necessarily a witch. It's supposed to be uh, a magician or something like that. And then, yeah, like, okay, I'm going to have to try to do something different. So I had, like, this red wig. I put it on. I put the necklace, which was the Melisandre neck that I had from before, from, like, a couple of years ago. And then with the mask. So basically, it's a couple of <laughs> – some people said, you look like a ninja, too. <laughs> so I said, yeah, it's kind of a mixture. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> no, it's great. You know, if people like that, and then they come, to the table, they take pictures with you, and you know, it's it's a lot of fun to be out there, like in the costume, and we we do that all the time. So our mm -hmm. table, and you can see probably in the table, there are not only my books, but like several books from all the authors from England's publishing. But uh, it's very cool because we can uh, talk about our books. You know, people buy, and they say like, "Oh, you're gonna sell like a romance in a comic con." What you never know what people like because you see, like maybe sure. the girlfriend is going with her boyfriend, and the boyfriend loves Thor, but the girlfriend hates anything nerdy, and then she'll yeah. find like a romance and go, "Hey, you know something that I like." <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> you never know where your audience is, right? So, like, the more the better, you know. Shooting it raw. Yes. 
Judy.